we are in a world that is becoming increasingly atomized and uh, we're all becoming isolated. It's a video game, but uh, it, you play it on the internet. And so it's not just you sitting at home lonely, sitting in front of your flickering screen. So there are people there that are playing the game at the same time. Prójimo es un programa de rehabilitación situado en Coyotitan, Sinaloa. Trabajamos para personas discapacitadas. Para las personas que ya aceptaron su discapacidad y necesitan usar silla de ruedas, una buena de silla de ruedas adaptada no los limita, al contrario, los libera. No poder mirar. Yo pienso que esa es la capacidad más, más difícil para mí. No poder mirar. La conozco mucho en sí. Y me gusta mucho así. La puedo manejar como yo quiero. Y no me tumba. Una silla de ruedas va a ayudar al usuario a movilizarse. Por eso debe ser cuidadosamente diseñada y adaptada de acuerdo a las necesidades de cada persona. Oh, ok, here we go. Uh, Atari had built this upright box called Touch Me, which had four big buttons on it and plays a game very similar to Simon or vice versa. I saw that and the execution was not, well, it was a dark cabinet. It made ugly sounds, but the gameplay was great. And part of what made Simon successful is because it sounded good. That. Otherwise, I'd be here forever. She insisted with the text and voicemail that she wanted some loving without the chain mail. You want to hang out and do some grown up stuff? Not really, babe. I'm busy fighting my thunder bluff. Hey, you want to hang out? I feel some magic happening. Oh, I bet it's magic, but it ain't the gathering. LOL, OMG, we could go before class. I'm at level 14. I'll pass on that ass. favorite moment uh, when racing is really the start because your concentration is really at the maximum it's 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 really stressful and when you've got the green light bah, you just go and and then you, you're just entering in, in another world so we're at uh, Virgin Megastore tonight on the eve of the release of the record in New York City and uh, we're really excited that this is actually happening here. It couldn't happen, I don't think, in a better place.